This is a two inch tri clamp beer keg style thumper with a half inch pipe going up the middle, ending right around where the sight glass is. Uh, a drain that you have to prime. This will keep the thumper from ever overfilling. Uh, pretty basic design. Uh, to prime it, you put your finger over the half inch hole and you fill it with water. You can use this thumper, if you really want to, you could use it as a gin basket. You could put copper packing into it, all of those things. Once it's filled up past the drain, it will start to drain out of it. Uh, this will prime the drain pretty quickly, and once that happens, you can let that go. And now your thumper is going to be filled up to here. I prefer it this way. Uh, it gives you more length of fluid for the bubbles to pass through coming out of your column. Uh, you add your cap on here, and now you're ready to go. If you want, you can have less fluid in here. Uh, you have to, to do that, you're going to need to cover the, act, the drain hole. And this will force the water through the main thumper hole. And what'll happen is, once that starts happening, having this cap in here will actually drain the entire thing out if there's enough fluid momentum going through it. Let's see if I can get it to happen. So now you have the thumpers primed. There's no fluid in the whole column and you can add a tiny bit more. Now you have a primed thumper with just a little bit of fluid in it. This is great if you don't want to have boiling water coming through your drain and heating this up. It's a good way to make sure that your thumper is working properly and that you've primed the drain properly. But again, personally I like having it filled up to here so it gives more of that thumper effect. Uh, the issue with that is you will get boiling water coming down the drain and it will be hot. It won't boil but it will be hot so you need to be aware of that. Uh, you don't want steam coming through this pipe or else your thumper is being bypassed and it's not working. So to make sure you're doing it properly I'd recommend draining the thumper body, filling it with a little bit of water and that way you can tell this pipe will stay cool when it's primed and you'll know that your thumper is working properly. Once you have it to where you know that it's working properly and you know how to prime it, filling it up to here will give you a better thumper effect. Uh, the advantage of this thing obviously is that it'll never overfill. So you can add these in series above each other and you won't ever have to worry about any of them overfilling. Uh, and the sight glass will let you add or remove fluid if you really have to without completely taking apart your column. Uh, these are great thumpers if you're trying to add a little additional power to a beer keg still say that you bought off eBay. As long as it's compatible with the 2 inch tri-clamp system, you're good to go.